In this tutorial, you will learn how to set up an In this tutorial, you will learn how to set up an alert notification. Alerts can be received as an email or system notification, depending on how you configured the recipient. Look at how alerts display on the home page. In this demo, Marcus Hoff's work visa is expiring soon, and we want to create an automated alert notification. Alert configuration is a four-step process. Step 1 is to create an alert message. Let's navigate to Manage Data and create the alert message. Enter a name and external code for the message. You can localize the alert header and description. Standard tags are available to be used as placeholders in alert messages. Step 2 is to create a workflow to identify the recipient. Go to Manage Organizations, Pay, and Job Structures. Add an ID and name for the workflow. Here, we'll set the employee as an approver for them to receive a system notification. We'll also set the employee in the CC role for them to get an email notification. Same with the employee's manager. Step 3 is to create a business role to automate the alert. Go to Configure Business Roles and select Generate Alerts as the rule scenario. Add a role name and ID. Our base object is the personal document information model. Our condition is to identify Canada as the relevant document country and be sure the expiration date is not null. In the then statement, we'll set the alert message to what we created in step 1. Set the workflow to what we set up in step 2. And set when we want the notification sent. Let's assign the role in BCUI.
Step 4 is to create an EC alert and notification job in provisioning. Go to Manage Scheduled Jobs and select Create New. Enter a job name and owner. Select EC alerts and notifications for the job type. We want this job to run daily. A recurring job will ensure the system checks regularly which records are valid for alerts and send the notifications accordingly. Select Submit or Run It Now to test the configuration. In the instance, the system generated alerts are in the For You Today section of the homepage.